for the first round. We have your Mewtwo versus Peach. <laughs> They're gonna go to Battlefield, Battlefield for the first round. For the first round. All right. So what we got here? So uh, how about the matchup between Mewtwo and Peach? Peach with a good air time, but of course Mewtwo has so many suits at his disposal. Uh, yeah, Mewtwo can just like throw out attacks. Versus, um, yeah. Not much against Peach though that I know of. Like I don't know if matchup per se because I don't play it. But I really just like the match against um, Peach with my character. <laughs> well, yeah, Mewtwo is one of the most, uh, I think... Yeah, I, he's, I, a, I he's like, a combo heavy character. Yeah, I, I, love, I really love that character. Such an interesting style of play. He's really fun to watch too. He, he does a lot of things. Yeah, so flashy. But right now, Gonde is sitting at 61% and Gabuaguida has had a comfortable 82%. We might be looking for a kill soon enough. Man, that that fair pressure from Peach though, it's so and it's lethal as heck. Oh my God. Ooh. In his face. The, the, the Will this be it? No, no, not yet, not yet. We're I mean, playing if, in if Battlefield, he, yeah, boys. If, if he gets it again, he'll, he'll kill it. Probably, uh, but yeah. just goes for the run up fair. The run -up fair. That's pretty fair. And Guaguida just really has to get this stock if he wants to get any chance of winning this. I mean, right now it's pretty safe for Guaguida. He's only at 28%, hasn't lost much to the stock lead. But Conde looks really comfortable where he's at. Ooh. And a forward smash is just gonna give him a lot of distance. But Conde come back to stage uh, and. He does so many good recovery. Yep. You can go to side B and then the. Oh my god, that, that's really annoying. He can just up air through the stage itself. Yeah, that, so the, the, the tail provides so much... Uh, Look at range. that hitbox. But that, that's, that's pretty comfortable for now, Conde having him at 47%. Ooh. Damn, but Conde going for that extra percent. Might cost him his life though if he keeps doing like random up smashes like that. Yeah, oh, and does Peach have... No, oh. Yeah, she do, but Ooh. not in center stage. Yeah. Ooh. Gonda has to be very careful. He's sitting at 150 percent. I thought he was gonna go for the Mewtwo combo. Yeah, the uh, Abadango one. Oh god. And the the dash attack from Peach, everyone knows the kills, boys. Yeah. I mean, anything at that percent should have yeah, killed. Oh yeah, of course. 150 and like Mewtwo is super. Rage um, 100, so much damage. Super light character. You but know, this game should that. be really comfortable for Gonda. He just has to sit back and like throw yeah, hitboxes until he lands one. Just a little bit more shield pressure. Yeah, can't get too can't get too excited for the killer drifty. But Gonda, pretty good player, pretty patient. He plays Lucario. Oh, Lucario! Let's see if he, if he might take it out. The way he's playing with Mewtwo, I doubt it. Yeah. He's doing really well. But then again, remember that Mewtwo's super light, and this is a Peach with almost like full rage. Full rage is at 170, but 121 is pretty good rage. But there oh, you go. go, game one the going to Conde. That sliding up smash, probably jump cancel too. Yep. Nice. Let's see what Ryan does to adapt to his Mewtwo. Pretty sure he's gonna change up the stage. Probably something with small size like Town City or. Smashville. Or a small roof too. Yeah. Which obviously both works both ways. Yeah. I guess they oh they got town and city there. Oh the racking of the perception. Yep, don't they just have to Try to get his ground and get center stage, but Ryan obviously not letting him. Ryan kind of trying to switch up his game style. As you can tell, he's playing a little more aggressive than last game. Sort of trying to adapt, but Gonda not really caring about it too much. He's he's just playing his normal, pretty passive, um, oh, bait and punish nice. kind of play style. 
That was, that was a close uh, get with the upcast. Yeah, that was really close. Could have been the kill. Ryan have to watch out. He yeah. got 91%. Yep. Now he can almost touch so many things. Oh. Nah, that should have been oh. the kill for Conde though. He, he forgot about the hitbox. The nah, he misplaced his fair. Yeah. He's going up. And Conde getting a little greedy for it, but not really getting too punished for it. But you see, he's just throwing out these attacks and he has to watch out for Peach's hitboxes too. I thought Mewtwo got hit there. Yeah. I thought she was gonna go for the bat, actually. She, Ryan's just looking for a back air or a forward air, to be honest. Doesn't want to throw out attacks that are too risky, so he's trying to go for the safe option. Okay. And the back throw gonna close this stock with. Doesn't usually kill, but the 132 rage yeah, really helping him out there. And, you know, decent damage from Mewtwo. Oh, there we go. Convert. One for one. One for one, just like that. Let's see how, how Ooh, this game nice, goes. Nice. Huh. They're just really much pretty much throwing out hitboxes. You gonna try to get center stage like they're playing the neutral pretty normally. I mean, not not just normal. They're just playing absolutely as safe as possible. Yeah. Well, Kwan getting hella damage. punished for now though, cause like he's taking a lot of percent. Could be risky for the future. I mean, a fair from Peach should already be killing near 90 or near 85. How much damage does the Turnip? Yeah, the turnip, you know, there's one of the turnips of Peach that she gets out. It's, uh, oh, Stitch Face. Yeah. That does about 30 damage, I think. Or 32, maybe 34. Maybe, my, maybe 24, actually. My bad. Okay. And the uh, knockback? Hella knockback. It has more knockback than damage. But she has another one called Dot Eyes, and I think it does 19 or 10. Okay. Somewhere around there. I'm not a Peach player, sorry. Yeah, no, it's just interesting, you know. Well, she can also pull out the Bomb Bomb, and she can also pull out the Saturn, and Saturn breaks shield. We need to see how much the percentage on each one is. Okay, so now well, that has to be compared. really even, but in reality, I think Mewtwo has a little few more safer hits than than Peach. But he just keeps throwing out that up smash. He can't do that if he wants to win this game. They get punished, and just like that, he got punished. We have one one. Yep. I bet we have a good game on our hands. We're going to game three, but one they have to stop doing the up smashes. Yeah, he's, he's, fishing, he's fishing too strong for those house matches and, yeah. he, and GTTA, he, he saw it, he got adjusted to it. Let's see how it goes. Let's see what map they choose. Can I go cut out now? Back, you come from the other Let's see which stage come the picks. He probably wants something to kill off the side. He probably wants something to kill off the side. Maybe uh, the ceiling? roof. No, like uh, sides, like the oh. blast zones on the side a little low. Okay. They're going back to Town and City, which is one of the smallest stages. It's good for both characters, but I, I personally think it benefits me too more because of the platform, so you can get some oh, yeah. fair strings. Okay. Ooh, nice. that was very cute. Gave him some cute moves there. Yeah, the B reverse into the shadow ball, just like from there. Pretty sure I just caught him off guard. That's yeah, why he didn't nice. shield. And these yeah, people just trading hits like crazy. <laughs> that that fair of Mewtwo is su such a good attack. Very one of the best fairs in the game. But Ryan not really letting up, telling yeah, him good, like, good. Yeah, good. I'm still in this. No, yeah, you, if you're gonna be aggressive, I'm gonna be aggressive too. I can't, I'm not gonna, he can't let up, you know, it's 1 1. Yeah, Ryan really, Ryan wants this game just as much as Gunner. Mm -hmm. Oh man, he missed that last game. If hit. I'm not mistaken, this game will take you to top 16. I think it, I think it does. Yeah, it does. Okay, so here whoever wins this game will so take top 16 and the other one will sadly be 17 yeah, under. So we, we, we're here. So that's why they want this so yeah. bad. Yeah, get top 16. Ah, Gonda getting the first kill. 
at a pretty comfortable percent too. He had only had 60 percent. Yeah, they, they were trading pretty evenly, but then uh, Conde has a good move. Yeah. Let's see how Ryan can answer this. Definitely not out of it yet. Right there, so almost taking the stock. Conde has to at least get something. Come on. He needs to get that damage he can eat. He doesn't he need to, but it would be a lot more comfortable oh, if he does. He doesn't want to go into the into the, with the last stock without no damage. Yeah, exactly. He he at least wants to get something like 40% to yeah, 50. Here we go. And here we go, just like that, an easy 30%. Yeah, Mewtwo showing Ryan yeah. that like. Even while dying, he can get that percent in for the second stock. And the little crouch. Yeah, the little crouch. Oh, picks it up. Now Ryan's getting kind of desperate for the kill, throwing out a bunch of attacks like forward smash and those two dash attacks. Ryan needs to calm down a little. He really oh, has to watch out for you to dub throw. The, the stage has a small. Oh, and is that it? Nope. No, but he is in up throw percent. Next attack is definitely gonna get it. They're both at kill percent. This is very tense. Gotta be careful. Some up. Oh. And Conde taking game three. Pretty comfortable Going to two top stock. 16 Conde. Congratulations. Congratulations Conde. He got into top 16 at least. 